what's up y'all welcome to another weekly vlog i know i talked to y'all last week and can we just get a round of applause because your girl's being consistent again with her weekly vlogs i left y'all hanging for like a month but i realized like my true supporters like my real 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 good sisters love my weekly vlogs and i feel like that's where we connect the most so though it be hard filming these and editing these for y'all i'm gonna do it for my real ones because y'all have stuck beside me but today is Monday. I literally have already gone to the gym, already done my morning routine, and I just got like semi-dressed. I just really did my face and my hair so I can kind of start my day. Today's packed, y'all. Today is packed to the pack to the pack. But I was smart last night. I knew I needed to get some stuff from Target and I knew I needed groceries. Well, we needed groceries. So I placed a Instacart order, which just came in, and then I placed a dry, our Target drive-up order, which I got on my way home from the gym. Now, I placed the grocery order because tomorrow we're fasting. Like, real fasting. I feel like I'm always on a fast, but really, I'm really not always on a fast. I just need to get my life together. <laughs> like, I just need to get my whole life together. So, we're going to do the Daniels fast together for 14 days. Me, Javon, and my best friend Eva are all doing it. So, it's just needed. So, if you've been needing, like, spiritual refreshment, renewal in your mind, body, soul, you should do it with us. Like, next 14 days straight up rabbits fruits and veggies like it's definitely gonna be a lot so we did the daniel's fast like i think it was probably around like october november of last year and we did it for five days and i was low-key struggling so i was like 14 days a little bit but we're gonna do it and i'm super excited for it so I hope you can join me um i'm gonna talk a little bit more about it tomorrow because that's when we're starting and we're also going to like meal prep and prep all these veggies and fruits that i got but we're gonna do that a little later today because i have to film a video after i'm talking to y'all and then we're filming another podcast episode today so i want to give you guys a little behind the scenes of that but this weekend my in-laws came in town and it was so much fun y'all we had great 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 times we ate so much good food and it was just a vibe overall but the house is looking a little crazy so i'm gonna film a clean with me so if you need cleaning motivation make sure to tap into my clean with me and i want to show you guys everything i got from target because i got a whole bunch of new cleaning supplies if you're not utilizing target drive up service what are you doing girl it literally saves you so much time so i got some new cleaning supplies really some of it's boring like i just got regular bleach because y'all know i'm gonna bleach something down i had the purple myers which was the lavender one which i liked it smelled really good so i decided to get the multi-surface one i don't even know what scent this is though but hopefully oh it's like the lemon it's a lemon one so hopefully it's good my um in-laws are still here but they're on their way out so then i got an oc or mop replacement because i feel like mine is really gross some of these, of course, to get all of the little nicks on our walls. My favorite, favorite laundry fabric softener. This is so good. Of course, we got a scrub. Money. And then I just got some white vinegar because, baby, white vinegar cleans so much stuff. And... I'm trying to be conscious of like the cleaning products I use because like one thing about me like I I will mix anything to make <laughs> something clean but I I'm trying to be more conscious of like what ingredients are in the cleaning products I'm it's it's a work in progress okay I'm not gonna be perfect overnight but I'm trying these are my favorite freaking gloves ever I put them on to wash dishes to wipe counters because you're not about to be touching them on my hands Sensodyne this is not part of the mix but yeah and then just the brush so we're literally gonna scrub this whole house down like i said i do clean with me so you gotta go tap in but i need to put on something that's not a robe and i just got some new clothes in that i want to show y'all so let's go into my bedroom so we can try them on okay y'all so you know i've been in like my athleisure bag which is why i'm so excited that our sponsor of the day is glow mode glow mode is a sister company on sheen if you're looking for the cutest most high quality athleisure wear 
they've got your back i've literally been obsessed i've been ordering left and right it's bad like i have to show you the jackets i've been getting because if you want those bbl jackets oh yeah baby they got all the bbl jackets i am obsessed with glow mode and i want to show you guys what they sent me first i'm gonna put on kind of like a whole outfit like a little outfit situation these oh my gosh just just wait till i put it on y'all so the first fit we have are these buttery soft leggings they're flare leggings oh my gosh they're so stretchy y'all so stretchy so cute they hug your body so nicely and this top this top this this little like corset athleisure but can actually dress it up and make it cute top the quality is what took me out y'all this is so like well built i was shook it's got a full zipper so you can zip it down if you want to but these leggings y'all their leggings are non-see-through they have a four way stretch and they're buttery soft like bud it's a 10 out of 10 for me okay glow mode's got your back here's a full body of the next fit these are the pants y'all have been harassing me about y'all are obsessed with these pants and so am i these are from glow mode and they are like the cutest pants ever so we've got another top this is kind of the same material as my last pair of leggings again very breathable buttery soft stretchy hugs you in tight and looks amazing now glow mode is most known for these leggings unfortunately they did not fit me but they're still so so cute so what's dope about these leggings is they have thermal technology so they keep you nice and warm as we're still kind of in a colder season also they're super 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 stretchy y'all like i mean look at the stretch now their two sizes fit most unfortunately i ordered down when i should have ordered up but these are super super cute and they also have pockets so if you're looking to put a little phone or a little gadget right here you can do that with these leggings so make sure to use my coupon code and check my description link so you can shop with glow mode today i'll make sure to have a discount code for you so you can get some money off in the process like i say baby you don't want to miss out on glow mode they got all the goods for an affordable price so make sure to tap into glow mode today jenna what do you have to say today no. Do we ever find that piece? <laughs> you don't have anything, anything to say. Y'all, today Genesis had sweet potatoes and bananas, and she was killing it. So we're setting up for the podcast now. Javon does like all of the creative directing, products. Dang. so he's just kind of getting everything together well we wait on my co-host eva's been out of town for a month now y'all i haven't seen her in a whole month so we're gonna do some catching up on the pod so make sure to this is not a toy you speak y'all this little girl needs a whole bath why are we always missing this piece i don't know if, I don't use that I that tripod. So, yeah, y'all. It's going to be a good episode, though. So, make sure to tap into the very much. Because very much. So, you need to tap into the very much. It is so hot out today, y'all. It's literally like 77 degrees outside. And I haven't even been able to really get outside today. Because I was legitimately scrubbing this whole house down. The clean with me turned out so good look she's trying to get the microphone <laughs> the clean with me turned out so good y'all genesis what are you gonna talk about this girl needs a bath she got little chunks of sweet potato all up on her you need a bath mama you need a bath mama oh, my my in-laws just left y'all it's a sad day like I appreciate like the help like my mother-in-law goes hard for us y'all seriously like she really does and it's just like you don't know how much you needed help until you get some help and it's like wow this is really great for sure so yeah really appreciative of that so I'm just trying to you know center myself 
sometimes i have days where it's like i just feel like robotic like today like cleaning the whole house for hours it just put me not in like a weird mood but i'm just like okay i need to do something interactive which is why i love doing this podcast because life can really feel so like routine sometimes and you definitely need something to break up the routine so if you've been thinking of starting a podcast if you've been thinking of starting a youtube channel if you've been thinking of posting your content like do it there's no other other thing to say like you have to do it and even if you don't get the feedback you thought you were gonna get keep on doing it keep on pursuing it because for me like i feel like the podcast is just like an outlet just and, and that's how i feel about my vlogs too just being able to talk to y'all and drop gems and y'all drop gems it really just get look at this little, little girl can you pick it up mama can you pick it up jenna next podcaster what's your podcast gonna be called genesis is corner <laughs> the parents got that joke the parents got that joke <laughs> okay, so i'm gonna update you guys when she pulls up so we can start filming you're kind of in my chair a little bit she's here she's here she's here she was literally just I feel like my face looks so puffy. Like, Genesis did not have the best night last night. She was like screaming, so I barely slept. Oh my gosh, this feels amazing. <sighs> yeah, girl, you did it. So I woke up and I prayed today, and today's the first day of the fast. The verse that I was led to meditate on throughout this 14-day fast is Romans 12:2 which says don't be conformed to this world but be transformed by the renewing of your mind so sometimes like i always hear like what's what is life after deliverance like what is life like after you give your life to christ and some people think like after you give your life to christ you don't struggle with sin no more and you just a okay and that is completely wrong you literally day after day after day after day after day have to renew your mind in christ renew your mind in who he says you are because there's so many lies and there's so many things that combat the word of god so first you have to know the word of god so when you hear a lie you can identify it as a lie and not truth and then you have to meditate on that meaning continuously reciting verses or meditating on that truth and then that becomes truth like sometimes we be meditating on lies so much that it becomes our truth when in reality it's a lie so this fast i'm really just focusing on being intentional with my thought life if a thought comes into my head that i know is not truth you literally just have to say i rebuke you in the name of jesus like there is power in the name of jesus don't downplay the name of jesus like speak to that thing and say listen i don't know who you are but i know who my god is and that's just on period so i feel honestly y'all i don't feel great this morning like my throat hurts a little bit my face is like super puffy from barely sleeping but we're here and i'm about to make our first daniel's fast breakfast which is literally just gonna be plain oats and bananas no added sugar no milk no dairy no nothing just like regular schmegular oats and bananas so let's make it i'll make us both brekkie so here's what i use so okay i want to tell you guys what you can't eat for Really what you can eat for the Daniels Fast. I mean, to make it simple, it's fruits, vegetables, nuts, and water. Like, that's really it. <laughs> There's nothing more than that. First, let's make Genesis's. She's gonna have some probiotic cereal. I'll just put a little in. And then I add some water. This pollen in Atlanta like it's so bad i have really really bad allergies but only with this pollen like i never had allergies in new york i'm going to crush up a banana one thing i have noticed with her as she's um give me a fork 
been eating food food, she definitely gets constipated. Which is why having that like baby constipation medicine, y'all see me put it in her bottles all the time. It's so important, because as soon as I put that in her bottle, she's not constipated anymore. So this is really what I've been doing, y'all. I have the whole pureeer, but it's like, girl, you could just mush it up. <laughs> like, literally, this is just what I've been doing. Here's Genesis's breakfast. Oatmeal and banana. You ready? Here you go. Good job, mama. Good job, mama. You so smart. You so smart. No, don't put your, and then she'll try to put her whole face in the bowl. Like just get another scoop. Here. No. Here. Hold your spoon. Good job. Yesterday she had sweet potato and banana and she loved it. It was amazing. So I'm about to make old fashioned oats. Just regular schmegular oats and bananas. The plan today, we do have to go run some errands. I need to return some stuff from Amazon and I need to get this nail fixed cause no ma'am ham. I got this done literally a week ago. So I'm gonna get those fixed. Genesis is putting her face in the bowl and we're gonna do this 14 day Daniel's fast. Like, I just need it. And I know by the end of this fast, I'm literally going to feel like a completely different person because that's what happens on every fast for me. And yeah, we just gotta get it together. Okay, what are you doing? Look, look at y'all. She picked the bowl up. This is supposed to be suction cup, first of all. Okay, where's your spoon? Hey, where's your spoon? You need to calm down. That's what you need to do, here. And she's like a complete mess every time. Titi, is it good? I know you love bananas. I know you love bananas. They're so yummy. Okay, swallow before I give you another one. Good job. Hold your spoon, please. Hold your spoon, please. There you go. Thank you. So plain oats, no sugar, no nothing. Like this is literally just oats on some like hunter gatherer stuff. But <laughs> not only am I about to be spiritually snatched, baby, this body, oh my God. Because my problem is I love carbs. Like carbs are my thing. Carbs and sugar. Like give me the sweets and give me the carbs. So now that I won't have any sweets and any carbs, besides healthy carbs, it's gonna be a whole thing, y'all. I know this, this, this oatmeal is gonna be so, so very, so very questionable. And I feel like this water's not hot enough. I'm gonna put this in the microwave because this ain't working out for me. Here's where we are. Day one of the fast. Brecky is about to be done. I'm literally still so tired, y'all. That's why I can't give y'all the energy I need to give y'all. So I'm going to tap in with y'all a little bit later. We're going to eat our breakfast. And I'll probably talk to y'all when we leave the house. What's up, y'all? So I am in my office getting ready for my first therapy appointment. Y'all know in last weekly vlog, in my last week's weekly vlog, I signed up for therapy and I have my first appointment today. Ciao. We got games. Like, I'm just like, what are, what are you... What happens in the first appointment like are you gonna try to understand my whole life do we take it slow like what's tea i guess we're gonna find out but y'all i was quaking like shaking in the knees we got past breakfast right you know we ate the oats horrible <sighs> here comes lunch i'm like this is a lot <laughs> y'all i'm serious like i did get weak but I prayed, you know, let me not say it like that. I prayed because that's my weapon. And then I made myself a nice salad. I had like some avocados, tomatoes, onions, and then I used olive oil, a little bit of sea salt and lemon for my dressing because you can't do like actual dressing. <laughs> Whoo, baby. And then me and Genesis went on a walk. It is literally 80 degrees. I'm sweating, but we're about to get ready for this. 
like who's ring ding ding in my line for my appointment i'm gonna set up like right here so it can be like a real chill like i want it to feel like i'm in somebody's office like you know i really need to go get this nail fixed y'all and if i don't get it fixed today i cannot get it fixed tomorrow because they're closed tomorrow i need to go get it fixed but i also have to edit a video so it's a lot i'm uploading all of the footage from yesterday onto a google drive eva's going to edit the next episode oh my gosh i'm so excited we're gonna put her in the editing chair the editing seat child i don't know she gonna edit it though and i'm super excited for her because editing is definitely intimidating at first but once you get the flow of it it's like clockwork today is like kind of like a slap in the face you know everything sounds good in theory like oh yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna fast for like 14 days like it's easy to say that but when it's time to walk the walk sometimes the knees be shaky and that's why it's so important when you're fasting like you cannot rely on your own strength like you are weak by yourself human nature we're weak but when you partner with god like there's literally unshakable strength like you can do it with god with yourself probably not but with god you 1000 percent can do it so i'm excited to just detox cleanse i'm gonna feel good from the inside out and it's all gonna be worth it and then i keep telling myself like girl it's 14 days like you can do 14 days come on you can do 14 days like i'm gonna bust out a little two weeks oh my goodness y'all yeah, so I'm going to get ready for this little fat appeat appointment. Hopefully after we'll be able to go get my nail fixed. And I also have a little snack. Very much fruit of the earth. This is nature's candy. Just keep telling yourself that. I have a wide range of experience. I enjoy working with women. Um, that's my that's my niche. That's my, yeah. Those are my people. Yeah. <laughs> And I, um, I really love practicing cognitive behavioral therapy, okay. which is you help a person change their way they think and you mm. can help them change their life. I love so. that. Wow. I didn't record much because, you know, confidentiality. I feel like a uh, weight. A whole weight just got lifted up off of me, baby. If you're not in therapy, I'm about to go to the side of the road and start holding up signs like get to therapy because for sure <laughs> that was so good. Mm. That was really amazing, y'all. Wow, I feel great. I do, I feel lighter. Um. I feel more capable. I've definitely like been struggling y'all like mentally, emotionally, spiritually. And I think identifying when you need help is super important. And also knowing that like feelings are normal. You know, the highs and lows of life are very, very, very normal, but you can't stay in that low for too long, you know? If you're in that low for too, too long, it becomes normal, it becomes comfortable, and then you truly believe that there's no way out of it. And I think that's where I was at, just being low for a little bit too long, that it got too comfortable for me. But I think just simply this therapy session was able to show me that there's more to life than the lows. And the lows are going to come, you know, they're going to come. But so are the highs and so is the joy and so is the happy like that's going to come as well but if the devil can convince you that right now here in this moment is what will be forever then he stole your joy and he has everything he needs with simply stealing your joy and your desire to hope and hope for a change hope for something new like if he can take that away from you he has everything he needs so this just gave me more hope and i hope that it can give you hope i pray that it can give you hope that whatever you're going through in this moment yes feel it 
Yes, understand your emotions, but know that this is a moment. This is not your life story. This is just a chapter in the book. Baby, it might even only be a paragraph. Don't get so stuck on this moment right now that you've convinced yourself there's nothing else worth living for or nothing else to hope for. There's so much to hope for. Therapy Maya is different. <laughs> Seriously, this is great. I love this for me. I really do. Yeah. I really do. Yeah. I'm going to go edit a video, y'all, for y'all. It's going to be a clean with me. So if y'all want to tap to the tip in, make sure to tap in. But okay, I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. Genesis is screaming, crying. I got to go figure out what's going on. What's up, y'all? Good morning. Look at my gym fit. I feel like it is so cute. This top is one of the tops I showed you guys in the beginning from Glomo. Like, baby. This is so freaking cute. Like, it's really giving Lulu dope. As you can see, I'm very excited this morning because we made it through day one. And I feel like if you get through day one, what are you doing? Just do the whole thing. I'm excited. I'm proud of myself. Um, I'm going to have my, my plain oats and some fruit and then i'm gonna head to the gym today is hair appointment day so we're gonna be getting this situation taken care of i think i'm gonna get a blowout and i'm excited y'all i feel like my confidence is growing because i would say i was gonna do something and then i wouldn't do it but now i said it and i did it so it's like you can't like I'm powerful, you know? Like, I'm powerful. I'm a woman of my word at this point. <laughs> Seriously, y'all need to be fasting with me. Like, I got this energy. I got this energy. You look so pretty this morning, team. Tomorrow, you look so pretty this morning, team. So, I'm gonna switch the oats. Last time I had, like, I wasn't feeling them, girl. They was too big. So, I'm gonna do these ones. But I'm just going to literally, see, these ones are, like, chopped up, which I like. I don't like the whole oats. So here's how they look, more chopped. And then I'm just gonna pop this in the mic. No sugar, no nothing. So yeah, today we'll be out and about y'all. I literally, now it's over for my nail. I think I'm gonna try to fix it on my own because the nail shop's closed today. And today's like my only day out this week. So it's like, I missed my opportunity yesterday, but I was literally editing. Like, what could I do? Oh, I had to get y'all to tape. Okay, y'all, so I have been ripping and running, and I didn't get a chance to say my morning prayer, so we are going to do that right now, first and foremost, before the day starts. Lord, Father, Abba, Jireh, Yahweh, Yeshua, my best friend. Lord, thank you for just waking us up just giving us another opportunity to live to be better to be closer to you jesus you know i was weak in the knees yesterday <laughs> but you gave me the strength i didn't know i had within me to get through that first day of my fast and i'm so grateful jesus it really goes to show that i can do all things through christ who strengthens me not through myself not through my own way not through will not through willpower lord but through christ who strengthens me so lord i just pray for all of my subscribers lord i just pray that your presence falls on them today that they draw near to you and as they do that you draw near to them father i just pray traveling mercies and protections over them as they're getting in their cars and going to their jobs and just doing the routine of life father god let them be protected and i just pray that as they're in their routine they find joy within their routine don't them don't let them get so concerned and so caught up in the mundane of life that they forget the joy connected to the little things father god when they go to work let them have joy when they go to school let them have joy unspeakable father god let them find joy in the little things today they don't have to have it all figured out they don't have to have things perfect but right now here in this moment joy is accessible so i speak joy over them i speak confidence over them i speak faith over them i speak favor over them i speak the hand of god 
over them, Lord, that they come in partnership with you on today. And when they come in connection with you, Lord, they're going to do things that they never thought were possible because, Lord, you have a strength that's undeniable. Father God, when we partner with you, all things can happen. Lord, when we partner with you, you do exceedingly abundantly above all we could ever hope, dream, or imagine. So, Lord, I want to be connected with you today. My sisters want to be in connection with you today, Lord. So we just speak you over everything we do. And we have peace with that. We have peace. We have peace knowing it's not our way. It's not our will. It's not our doing. But our Father is working with us through everything we do today. So, Lord, we thank you. We honor you. And we praise you. And we love you so, 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 so much. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. But we just pulled up to the gym. So we about to get these good, good in, okay? We about to get this good, good workout in. And I will talk to y'all after the gym. Daniel's Fast Edition. Let me show y'all. What's up, y'all? I don't have the right tripod, y'all, so it's like not giving. Towel roll. I did. That's literally a paper towel roll. Okay. Chipotle, the Daniel's Fast Way. Let me show you. Because this is what I did for a majority of the day. So last time I did this Daniel's Fast. So. I don't know what the SO means. I know yours. So Mine has. Let me see. Mine has corn, so. Oh, yeah, that's me. Yeah. Ooh, that look good. Let me get that little block. So tell them what you got. Tell them what you got. So what I got was, uh, I like both beans in my burrito. So weird. She protein. accidentally put both in mine. It was. So nice. Which one do you want to get, black? I only get black. Pinto good though. So I got black beans, pinto beans, tomatoes, brown rice, extra guac. You probably didn't even do the extra part. Uh, and so, what is it called? So Frida's? So also, so you got it too? No, I didn't get it. So Frida's, and so it's just tofu. Mine's a veggie bowl, y'all. So mine is brown rice, um, veggies, tomatoes, corn, guac. This look good, it smells bang. It looks really good. I don't know if vinaigrette's part, but vinaigrette don't have to be a part. But it's a decent little, little I'm gonna need some little judge. Right. This vinegar is like natural, so I don't know, y'all. Mind mm -hmm. If that's the case, we could have had a regular salad. <laughs> I don't know if I want that. It smells it's like sweet. Yeah, it adds just a little tiny so weight. Yeah, sugar in it. Yeah, that's right. Oh Lord, I was struggling, mm -hmm. but you got me through. And I just thank you. I just thank you for this opportunity to deny ourselves for you to deny ourselves for our spirits, Lord, because our spirits are in need of refreshment and renewal. And we thank you, Lord, that you see our efforts, you see our struggle. We are dust. We are nothing but dust of this earth, Father God. But with your spirit, we are strengthened. With your spirit, Lord, we can do all things. So we just thank you for this opportunity to serve, that we can deny our flesh and serve you. So Lord, we thank you, we honor you, we praise you that all things will work out for the greater good of your plan over our lives. Amen. Amen. Let's try it. I haven't had a veggie bowl in so long. Ah, uh, you got me fajitas. I don't like fajitas. You don't like veggies? Well, I mean, I'll eat them though. That's the whole point of it. Mm-hmm. No, we probably good. Mm -mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 No. Yeah. Right, yeah. Try mine. No, you have to try mine. Try right? Sofrida's. Okay, but try mine too. Tofu, make sure you get some. Try mine too. Mm. Not as good as mine. It's got corn and 
Sugary. Chipotle's syrup. corn is unmatched. Are you kidding me? That's good, y'all. Thank you. Let's go. Yes. Okay. Let's go. I got corn. So now you like corn. Chipotle's yeah. corn is different type of corn. It's not regular mm. corn. And it adds that little pop. Y'all, so mm. I've been working out pretty consistent, right? The heaviest I've ever been is like 165. Tell me why I don't put on 30 pounds this year. That's a happy weight. That's a married weight. 30 pounds, but it's but I still got abs. Not this year. Last year. Right. Well, over the last couple months. Right. And I still got abs. Like, it was just like all muscle mass. I've never weighed 195 ever in my life. Right. That was always a goal. Like, man, if I could just the best shape in my life, I would get to 185. Really, it was 185. I'm 10 pounds. That's a lot of cups. My girl. Did you look in there? None in the dishwasher. What if somebody stole only our cups to like mine for us? We are doing a family wall right here, and we just got our mixed tiles in. We're gonna do it in this vlog probably tomorrow, but like we're gonna do one in the hallway and then we're gonna do one here. This one's gonna be like the big one because we got 12 eight by eights. And then that one we got, um, I think eight eight by eights. It's gonna be so cute, y'all. The pictures we did, they're black and white with black frames. It's gonna look so good. So I actually need to hurry up. I have 30 minutes to eat and then I'm gonna go hit my hair appointment. So I'll talk to y'all in the car. Ship combo okay y'all we're here i just pray montasia can get me in and out i really don't want to be here for that long but it's only a maintenance so i'm just gonna get my hair pressed out maybe a little curl swirl so hopefully it doesn't take long but who knows who knows okay y'all ready y'all ready to go come on girl at this point like i just love vlogs because we're really on the phone you know like we're on the phone and i just need somebody to be on the phone with me that's my thing that's why I, I just be throwing people's vlogs on literally to just have background noise like please don't make me feel alone <laughs> just got my hair washed so we're gonna start let me put you guys up a little bit okay i just got my hair washed so we're gonna start the pressing of it all they redid redid they put a little decor a little decorum looks real cute in here and they got a little desk at this point i'm their most loyal customer <laughs> Can you say good morning? Here's your toy. Okay, but are you ready to read your word? Are you ready to read? I mean, it's the book of Isaiah. It's a little heavy. Do you think you're okay with that? It's a little bit heavier. But I mean, there's some good stuff in here. So we're going to read about the judgment 
on Jerusalem and Judah. Okay, I'm going to take your toy away so you can focus. And then we'll play when we're done. See now, the Lord Almighty is about to take from Jerusalem and Judah both supply and support. All supplies of food and all supplies of water. The hero and the warrior, the judge and the prophet, the diviner and the elder, the captain of 50 and the man of rank, the counselor, skilled craftsman, and clever enchanter. Okay, but don't rip, don't rip, please. Okay, that's not a good idea. I will make mere use their officials. Children will rule over them. People will oppress each other, man against man, neighbor against neighbor. The young will rise up against the old, the nobody against the honored. A man will seize one of his brothers in his father's house and say, you have a cloak, you be our leader. Take charge of this heap of runes. But in that day he will cry out, I have no remedy. I have no food or clothing in my house. Do not make me the leader of people. All right, y'all. So we just read our word and prayed. This is my new Bible. So you guys know I was rocking with the one year woman's Bible for like three years. So I was like, I think it's time to upgrade. I got an illustrations Bible. It is so thick and heavy. So basically what's dope about this Bible. Oh, this is fitting. Let's pull up to the chapter of Genesis. Basically, it gives you room to just annotate when you're reading so you can really digest. Recently, what I've been doing is like, hey, baby, can you play with this one, please? That one's a little bit loud just while mommy's working. Um, I've been highlighting, but like a strategic highlight. So I got these highlighters. There's a whole bunch more, but they're really cute, like pastel highlighters. And what I do is, let me go, because I'm right now I'm reading the book of Isaiah. I color coat stuff. My nail is, I'm just about to get a whole new set on today, y'all, because this is ridiculous. But for God's command, I'll use like my pink highlighter. For God's promise, I'll use green. And for God's character, I'll use blue. So something I highlighted for God's character is in Isaiah chapter 1 verse 24. It says, therefore the Lord Almighty, the mighty one of Israel declares, ah, I will vent my wrath on my foes. I will turn my hand against you. I will thoroughly purge away your dross and remove all your impurities. I will restore you leaders as in days of old, your rulers as in beginning. Afterward, you will be called the city of righteousness, the faithful city. So what I got out of this is that God can restore and that goes to speak to his character. So I've been doing this for a while, just, just annotating like this and it really helps me to digest the word. This is the NIV version of the Bible. So it can be like a little tricky when you're reading it you're like okay what is this actually saying so when you take just an extra second and you really meditate on what the word is saying it gives you confidence to feel like okay i actually digested this text instead of just reading through it you know so what i've been doing with genesis as of recently is every other day the days i'm not working out like today i'll come upstairs and we'll do like a little bit of school a little bit of teaching so do some interactive playing We'll read books like we're going to read this book about parts of the body today because she's been cracking up whenever I say like nose and I'll point to my nose. She thinks it's the funniest thing ever for whatever reason. So it's time to learn the parts of the body. So we're going to read that book today and then she's just going to do some colors today. So we have this little spin wheel and we'll just spin and talk about the colors. But I do love this Bible, y'all, and it's leather. It's a really high quality Bible. I'm going to link it in my description as well as these highlighters in case you want to take my method of just annotating your text like I do. But we got to talk. I fell down hard, hit my knees, scraped them. As I was coming home from my appointment that I was at all day, baby, I fell and I broke fast. And it was very tragic. I'm weak. Like, I am very weak. And I really should have prayed my way through it. But I was listening to my flesh. And I was like, you need to go to Taco Mac and get you some food. Because you deserve it. And you've been out all day. I'm not proud of it. But I will say, 
the time I was fasting, I feel like it really, really helped me get what I needed to get out of it. I feel like I was solely focused on God and it allowed my spirit to be refreshed. Though it was like three days, y'all, two or three days, I am still proud of myself and I'm going to still continue to eat clean. I can't guarantee it's gonna be a complete Daniel's fast, but I'm at least doing no processed sugar and no fried food for the next like 10 days. Um, I mean, yeah, we, we fall down, but guess what? We get up. <laughs> I tried y'all. I feel like I really could have made it through last night, but child, I got weak in the flesh. I'm not proud of it, but what can you do? You can try again. So I think, um, also Javon, let me not even talk about Javon. <laughs> We're going to revisit the Daniels Fast at a later date, but I am going to continue to eat clean and it is what it is. You gotta be honest with yourself sometimes and I'm not perfect, but I do hope that you guys can continue to Daniels Fast if you are, because baby, you gotta get into it. And <laughs> Daniel's fast like when you really do the whole thing are so transformational but I feel like I I did get something out of the couple of days I did fast so I'm proud of that okay Genesis we see you on a roll hey let's not grab the camera what's up with you doing that hey look at your book hey look at your book Genesis look at your book oh book let's look at your book okay are you ready parts of me nose can you point to mama's nose now you don't want to laugh no it's not funny nose how about we sit up you don't need to lay down babe you've been laying down all night girl dim, dim. sitting up nose nose can you point to your nose can you point to your nose that you smell things out of? Nose, nose. Hey Genesis, can you point to your nose? Nose, nose. Mouth, 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 mouth. Can you point to your mouth? Your cheeks? You like her by cheeks? Do you see my cheeks? She's trying to eat my sock. Okay. Okay, tell me time. Is that what this means? Good job, way to roll. Can you show us how you roll, roll, roll? Can you tell us how you roll, roll, roll. Roll! You're rolling! Yay! Yay! To my dumb, to my dumb, strong girl, to my dumb. Boom boom, ti ma dum, ti na dum, boom boom, ti ma dum. You're so strong. Okay, let's learn our colors and then we'll be good. Red. This is red. You landed on the color red. Red, red, red. This is red. Good job. You landed on red. Green, green, green. This is green. Do you see how this is green? Time for a home project. I told y'all we got these mixed tiles. Not sponsored. Although y'all definitely should have sponsored a curl, but we're not gonna talk about it. Um, basically y'all, it's like the command hooks of pictures. So it does no damage to your walls. Cause we have a lot of pictures we wanna put up and we was not trying to Honestly, I thought they would be better quality than this, you know. Look at this. It's like a little piece, so. Oh, they already got the pictures in it? Yeah. That's not bad. That's not? Let me see. Let me I feel it. like it doesn't feel high quality. Oh, oh yeah, it's because you touched it. But you can't tell just looking at it, though. Yeah. When you feel it, it feels cheap, but, like, when you're looking at it. But, I mean, you also went that route, though. 
Because you didn't want to do that. These checks was $100. That ain't cheap for no pictures. Y'all. <laughs> we just weren't about to get the huge ones. These are going to be so cute. They're not bad. When we organize them, they're going to be really cute. Yeah, they look good. Very good. Actually, yeah, we can do that. Okay. These all on the Excuse ground because there's 12, so we can kind of see how we want to place them. And then Where there's this... Things? This is the right there on that wall. Oh no, let's do that before they, they get here. So, Jordan. back is literally this little sticker. You peel it off, pop it on. Pop it on, what's in here? Nothing, nothing's in here. So I'm gonna organize these all on the ground and I'll show you guys how they look before you put them on the wall. Okay y'all, clearly they're not like spaced evenly, but here's how I'm going to arrange them pictures are so cute y'all we got our wedding pictures look at me prego so cute we got when genesis was a little baby genesis now so cute yeah we're gonna take this and put it on the wall the finished result i love it y'all it looks so good. Look at all our pictures. Every little family. Genesis. But these were really easy to apply, y'all. They went on the wall super easy. I do want to get like a big pompas. This is not giving, but it's just temporary. I want to get like a really big and dramatic pompas for right there. And I think it's going to set it off. Okay, so we're about to go get something to eat because I'm starving. And then we're going to go to Sephora. Where's my jacket? Is this a prank? I, I don't know why I get my hair pressed out when I just immediately want to put it up. I just don't like stuff on my face. Okay, where is my little jacket? Where is my little jacket? Mr. We haven't had Mr. Ten Lizards. Ten Lizzies. Okay, you, I think I probably put my jacket with your stuff. When I get home, I will be searching for my jacket, y'all. I don't know where it is. I'm just gonna put on this black top. We're literally not going barely anywhere. Like, we're gonna go get some food and then go to y'all hear genesis go to sephora but me not finding this jacket i will not be at peace until i do because this is just criminal do i want to wear jeans lol no actually let me try these on just to do a little judge and i'm definitely wearing my phones because i am not about to wear no fancy schmancy Ugh. okay i'm gonna wear these jeans hold on let me show you guys these are one of the few pairs of jeans that fit me postpartum i actually got them from sheen y'all the waistband is just like a little bit loose i would like them to fit better but we don't really have many options. Oh, my hair. Like, I just got my hair done, y'all. And I'm already like, can we take this out? I just don't like dealing with stuff in my face. It's so annoying. Okay, this is what I'm wearing. The most basic outfit. But what can I say, baby? I can't say much. Genesis. And then the scent will do. Soul day. In order to get up out the house, you just gotta ignore those cries for like five minutes. Cause girl, if I stop every time you cry, you ain't never gonna leave. But we about to leave soon. Did I ever ask you 
her take me to go Shopping in Paris I go Sailing overseas and just drape me in Gucci no. Cheers Where we at? We at Ross Where we at? We at Ross Where we at? Baby, we at Ross Like, I haven't been here in so long Hello Wait, Javon, look at these headphones Javon. Here, go ahead and grab me some. These ones, JBO ones? Yep. I need them over the ears. For sure. Y'all, Ross got the hookup. I have some headphones that literally are so loud and good quality. They're like $16. Y'all, we only have four minutes on this SD card, so I'm gonna get what I can. What, what are you looking for? Okay, this card is about to be filled, but I'm gonna do a haul when I get home. What's up, y'all? Just got home, and I promised y'all a haul. Honestly, I didn't think I was gonna find anything because it was looking crazy at first, but as I spent more time in there, of course, I found stuff, so let me show you. I found this huge candle. Like, y'all, this thing is literally so big really just love like these low rounded ones because they fit perfect on the island and i like the little wood top it is so bright i like the wood top and it's just a cute candle but it also smells amazing and it's got one two three four five six wicks so it's gonna be really pretty when it burns oh i didn't even read this i don't even know it's got like a hole it just smells like a spa. It's very light, um, like eucalyptus. Let's see, what's the scent? Soothing lavender. I knew it had some lavender in it, like a little eucalyptus lavender. Very relaxing. So Genesis is growing out of all of her clothes. So I got her some nine-month clothes. It's so crazy, and it's so, like, almost sad. Like, this girl's growing up so fast. So Ross has a lot of Carter stuff. So I got this one. It's got a two-way zipper, which I like. And then I got her, she'll either sleep in these or just like lounge around the house in. She looks so cute in yellow. Like, look at how big these are, y'all. My baby's getting so big. And then I got her this cute outfit with the little apple. And it's like a three-pack. Oh, oh my gosh. Some dresses it's getting summertime so i want to have something where she can be a little bit more free and she got a daddy's girl one because it's necessary this one is six months so she's gonna have to wear this soon and i think i want to do placemats on the table i feel like it just needs some contrast because it's just wood and especially because we just put up that like picture wall so i got these <laughs> let me show you up close kind of the texture on them and they're kind of like an off-white i feel like these are going to look good and if they don't maybe they're going right back kitchen towels because we've been in need and these ones were super cute a little white and nude and then i found these um who is us polo assassin girl this is knock off ralph lauren but all i know is that get you some white washcloths you know when they're dirty and that's just all you need to know. Like, don't be trying to get colored washcloths. If you're washing your body, get you a white washcloth because if it's dirty, you need to know. You don't have no black that hides the dirt. Don't have no gray, have white. So I got some new white ones and these are really soft. And then I got some granny panties, but I'm not gonna show y'all. And then I got a muumuu. Y'all, I was literally about to order a muumuu off of Amazon. <laughs> and although I don't like this little dog situation because it's giving lulu ptsd but i just need me a move i just need me something where i can walk around and let everything just walk around with me you <laughs> do you know what i mean like i needed to get me a little momo so okay y'all that's it that's everything i got javon got a whole bunch of stuff he got shorts he got 
headphones and everything like that so i'm about to go to bed it's been a long day i'm tired and yeah i will talk to y'all tomorrow i think tomorrow's gonna be the last day of this vlog so we'll wrap it up tomorrow hit our workout in the morning and yeah love y'all it's friday friday Gotta get down on Friday. Everybody's looking forward to the weekend. Weekend. Part. Okay, sorry. Um, it's Friday. Basically. I have been drinking out of this Dunkin' Cup for the last two days. But this cup with this glass straw, I don't know. I don't know what's in it, but basically. Oh, also I have an Alani. So I've been drinking Alani's as of recent. Here's the one I have to dye. Come on, come on. I think it's like a tropical sitch. Um, honestly, no energy drink is good for you, but y'all been on my neck about Celsius's. And I've like, I've seen a lot of people say, you know, Celsius's on a daily. Well, I don't even drink them on a daily. Like I'll probably have like one or two a week. Like, you know, cut me some slack. But um, I'm just trying to not be on that wave anymore. So we're gonna we're gonna go the Alani way and see how it works out. Alani actually has mad stuff. I, I was at um, CVS yesterday and they have like protein. They have like little gummies, girl. They got mad stuff. So and my trainer actually put me on to Alani. So see, it takes too much like soda for me. Like for me, I liked the Celsius is because. I have like an orange one or like even like the lemon lime one and it's like not as soda-y but this tastes like straight soda and it's like 9 a.m. Also, I missed my 8 o'clock workout. So sad. But my trainer was like, hey, me and Tony, my other trainer, are about to work out. Do you still want to come? I'm like, immediately yes. Like, my good sis is we about to get it in. It's about to be a great workout. I already know. So, they're doing their meet me at the bar workout so basically my two trainers have come together to do a bi-weekly class where you can like pull up if you're in the metropolitan atlanta area and you are looking to learn the basics of fitness be more confident in the gym learn proper form pull up to the meet me at the bars um i'm gonna have both of their instagrams down below so y'all can follow them because they're always posting about it so y'all can just stay up to date but it's a dope collaboration they're doing and it's very very helpful if you're new to the gym i have had tony's glasses for like three weeks and i keep on forgetting to bring them to her but i'm going to bring them right now so let's get this workout in y'all it's about to be a great friday let's get it Okay, y'all just got back from the gym. And me and Genesis are about to go visit her god mommy. Genesis has actually never been over there, so I was like, let me go grab lunch for us and we can just chill out over there. She works from home, so we're gonna go over on her break. And yeah, so I'm gonna meet y'all in the car, but I was just packing up some stuff. Literally y'all, I stopped with a diaper bag. Like we have like four diaper bags and we never use them. I just have a big tote and I just put all her stuff in here and it's so much easier. So if you a new mommy, don't be wasting money on all them diaper bags. Just get a big tote and it will yeah. do the trick, yes. okay? So, so go let's go to the car. Yeah. And go pick up our food. Bag secured. I drove all the way to where we used to live because I used to get this salad from this Mediterranean spot all the time. And it's literally undefeated. It's like the best salad I've ever had. So got our salads. Now we're gonna go pull up to her house. Y'all, the workout today, are you kidding me? My, is this traps? Girl, they told me what it was. Now I forgot, not traps, lats. Girl, I think it's a lat. My lats, girl, whatever it is. I can't, I can barely lift up my arms. And obviously it's just me and Genesis, so like I've been having to get her out of 
her like car seat thing which takes a lot of lifting baby i am on the brink like <laughs> seriously oh i should stop and get a coffee i'm definitely stopping and getting a coffee sorry i just need it and honestly i told y'all last vlog i've been a dunkin girl i switch on and off from dunkin to starbucks but honestly starbucks sounds really good right now like sometimes dunkin they don't be hitting and this one that i'm going to usually don't be hitting uh, i'm already in line at this point <laughs> like, so y'all the workout was insane like don't let two trainers get together because they're gonna put you through the craziest workout ever like i was like girl y'all got me fighting for my life and tony's just standing there all cute all pretty like breathing normal i'm like is there something wrong with me <laughs> like seriously but no their meet me at the bar workout was intense so if you just need to get snatched just get your whole life together y'all gotta go to the meet me at the bar because you need to meet at the bar you know but um yeah so we're gonna go pull up in the Sri Lanka <laughs> Genesis has never been to her auntie's house so I'm so excited for her and like Eva bro loves this little girl like throughout my whole pregnancy she was so supportive she was always there like she's really a real one so it's just so crazy that we're full circle now that like Genesis is here like I'm not just big and prego anymore the baby is in the mix <laughs> but okay y'all I will talk to y'all when we get there aunties you are Right. So Juicy was calling her out because she faked a whole pregnancy. Juicy knew she faked it, so she was like, let me play you a baby shower. <laughs> and then she had black balloons. Oh my god! That's so petty. But who fakes a pregnancy though? Like, that's not cool. How did Pastor Trevor find out about the news? Did he know about the situation that's going on around? No, I haven't got a chance to talk to him. Like, I went to go talk to him, but it was not the first time. <laughs> how do you think he did? Especially those twins, they cry so unexpected. Like, they be chilling. And then they're straight tears. <laughs> no, but that's how Candace was in Potomac. Did you ever watch Potomac? Yes. Literally, she was zero to 100. They, they dragged Candace at the reunion. Did you watch the reunion already? Of what, Potomac? No, not Candace. No, Candace got together the, the evil green-eyed bandit. In the new season? Yes. The newest you, season reunion yeah. is out? I think so, yeah. Oh, I think watching all the snippets. They were wearing blue. What? Oh my gosh, it's out? Wait, no, 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 no. We gotta watch that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, good. Because it was about time. Because I finished the last episode and I was waiting on the reunion. Here's Bravo on the Google Play Store. Girl, we been there, done that, got the t-shirt. Like, it didn't work. Look at Why this. Why did they install? We're in France. So what's the UK? The UK, they drive on the opposite sides of the no, road. No, I'm saying like, where's where the UK? Like, what is that? That's a country. That's where London is. <laughs> London and Paris are the same thing? No, well, no. London is like you say Paris. And the UK is France. Wait, 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 wait. London is to Paris as the UK is to France. So the UK is a country and then London is a city in the country. Wait, I'm what's what's a country? It. The UK, United Kingdom. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then what's a what's a city? So France and the UK are countries. Oh. And then Paris and London are cities in those countries. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna Girl, we even need. Why? Please don't okay, ask me to log Genesis. in. Like, this is you, you were just telling me you're hungry. What's up, y'all? It is actually a few days later. It is the next Monday. And I'm sitting here editing and I realized, girl, I ain't never filmed an outro. Like I was just gonna leave y'all hanging, clearly. <laughs> so I'm hopping back on just to tell y'all that I love you. Thank you for watching this very lengthy vlog. <laughs> I feel like this is one of my longer vlogs. So if you say to the end, baby, you a real one. And comment down below your favorite fruit. If This is how I'm gonna know the real from the <laughs> okay so comment down below your favorite fruit it's gonna be a little inside choke girl we're gonna know who really about it about it anyways i love you i appreciate you god bless you girl i'm gonna call you next week
So pick up the phone. Don't play around, okay? All right, Mwah. bye.